Hi, I'm Jeff with Suprema Tech Support for the North America office. I'm here today to show you the unboxing of a core station. Um, so you may have gotten one with our four door access control kit. Um, so this is the box you see in the distribution um, where you may purchase it from. So let's put this inside. I've already unboxed this. This is the box for the core station itself. So if we just open that up. Well, first to note here is on the side here is a sticker with the serial number of the core station. So um, that's the same number when using BioStar 2. When you search for devices, it'll identify as that number. So let's open this up. So in here we just have some offset mounting screws and a post. So, and then nothing else in there. Go to the side, go to the side, core station. Um, that's what it looks like here. And then we open that up. that inside so that's core station so what we have here is you have four door ports on each <clears throat> and at the bottom is the incoming power to power it and some couple of auxiliary inputs um, so now with the core station I'll just cover one door port here well what we have here actually door ports start with zero so zero one two and three um, so each door port here I'll just cover this one up top um, we have a relay here, so you got normal close, common, open, standard relay. So you have your inputs for your door position, door contacts, and your request to exit buttons or motion detectors, whichever you use. Um, so you got, and each one has two leads for each device. Um, then we have TTL out, that's if you're using third party readers, and you want to control the LEDs on them to indicate a valid read. Then we have a weakened input. Um, once again, using a third party uh, reader for that has weak and output from the reader. Um, 12 volt and ground for the out to power side readers and so forth. And then we have a 485 connection. Now, if you're using our readers, you would want to use the 485 connection for the data communication to our readers in that case. And then you can um, daisy chain up to, I believe, 31 readers or 31 devices off one of our 45 ports. And the core station can do up to 62 devices off of it. And we actually have four RS45 ports. So one in each door port here and here. And then we have a host one at the top. So you can daisy chain up to five different legs going out up to 64 devices total and up to 31 devices per leg. Um, and then let me flip it over here on the top as well. We have the ethernet connection. That's how you connect to the network and use our BioStar 2 software to connect and configure the device. And then once again, 12 volt power coming in, a couple of auxiliary inputs. Say if you have an enclosure, you have a tamper on the enclosure, you can wire it into that as well. Um, and on the board, once again, for the door ports, you have a relay light, which will come on if the relay is actually active and engaged. And it tells you the different inputs, if they've been the violated in different conditions, open, short, and so forth. And they can be supervised. They can be configured to be supervised or not supervised. Um, once again, on the center here, each one will be different because this is, has the serial number again. That was the same serial number that was on the box from pre previously. So that's where, we'll, if you happen to call in tech support, we may need the serial number if you're having an issue with a device. Um, and then also we have a battery here, like on a PC motherboard or anything, it has a little plastic tab. You pull that once you're doing the installation. Um, and that's really it for the core station at this time. Thank you very much. Have a good one.